A date for the long-awaited verdict in state MP Bernard Finnegan's child pornography case has finally been set. Court reporter Kim Robinson is at the district court. Good evening, Kim. When will Finnegan learn his fate? Well, Kate, nearly seven months after Bernard Finnegan stood trial on charges of attempting to obtain access and obtaining access to child pornography, we will find out next Tuesday whether or not he is guilty. The verdict will be handed down by a judge at 2pm on Melbourne Cup Day. That's just half an hour before the race that stops the nation. Now, it's been an extraordinary case beginning four years ago when on the 20th of April 2011, Finnegan was arrested and charged charged with four child pornography charges. He resigned from Labor's cabinet the very next day. A month later, Finnegan faced court for the first time. Over the next four years, legal twists and turns dominated the case. A suppression order was lifted, then imposed, then lifted again in a landmark decision. Then almost four years ago to the day, the 42-year-old stood trial on two charges. Now just a week remains until the ultimate decision and if he is convicted of the charges. He faces a maximum penalty of five years behind bars and he will lose his job but if acquitted of the charges he will be able to uh, hold his upper house, upper house parliamentary position until his eight-year parliamentary term expires in 2018.